we have some big hits, some big hits to try. But before we try and dive into this pack of big hits from our friends who secure things with Allen keys, I need to ask you a thing. You know it's coming. Lots of people say these things. If you could um, like, comment and share my video. There is also a facility to subscribe and um, get notifications. This is things that you can do. So if you can do them, grand. We need to look at this, don't we? We need to look at this. these IKEA food biscuits. These are Kaffa Rep. That's how I'm going to say them. Ginger Thins with almonds. I've had Ginger Thins before on a number of occasions. I'm not sure I've had any with almonds in them. Um, I thought give them a try. They are in this really pleasing box. They are round, as far as I can tell. There is an image on the top. These were these were on family card offer, so these were 95 pence. They're not normally 95p, so they were a bit more than that. I think they were like 120 or something like that. And if we need to know what's found within, we need to find the English, so I can actually read it. There it is there. Once open store, we're in an airtight container at room temperature. Do I have an airtight container? Uh... No. Oh dear. Oh dear indeed. Anyway, not going to worry about that right now. Not going to worry about that now. No point worrying about it. Nothing I can do about it. Let's just open the pack and take a, a look at what's in here. So, yeah. We have a box. We have a few tickets. Yeah, you can see bits of almond. You might be able to catch that. There. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Almost that peak almond thin season. Obviously, they're available all the time, but in tins, not so much. Definitely smell the the ginger thins, and here they are being all thin. Yeah. As you'd expect, quite biscuity. So, um, yes. They are thin and they're quite brittle. They're definitely ginger. Ginger is the very predominant flavour, and you get bits of almond. Not sure what else to say. You like your ginger thins, and you want a little something else. This is worth a shot. Worth a shot indeed. Now you get an airtight container. Bit of a whoopsie, but anyway, we'll gloss over that. So if you happen to find yourself in Ikea and you need some ginger thin biscuits along with your Billy bookcase and your um, Billy bookcase um, Biscuits? Who'd have thought it? Ikea and biscuits. It's a wild combination that I've known for quite some time and many people have. Anyway, thank you for watching. Um, I recommend biscuits because biscuits are tasty. Uh, yeah, and there'll be another video tomorrow. But if you want to watch something from the past, they are around here. You can watch something from my back catalogue and something that may or may not still exist in retail stores. Bye, bye.